Hello friends, welcome to HTML tutorial series. I double click on default.html page. I right click on default.html page open with the notepad. We are learning how to create our own simple profile by using HTML. In the previous tutorial we understood how we can create web page layout. In this tutorial we are going to add content to this web page and make it little bit more better. Let's proceed and get the information. First of all, I go here, I remove the height, Control X, File, Save, go to browser and refresh. Now what we do, we are going to add a photo here, we are going to add a picture. You can see that I have an image at the desktop with the name picture.jpg. So I go to the second row here. Here we need to add a photo, right? There I am going to use img tag src equal to in double quotation I say picture picture dot jpg. Then I say forward slash greater than. We know that image tag is a unpaid tag. We are putting that inside this td. File save. Go to browser and refresh. You can see that the image got added. Next thing I need to add some details here on the right hand side. To add the details on the right hand side, I have already some details written in a notepad. I am going to open that. You can see some details I have here. I am going to copy this content from here and I paste it in this default.html page. Here the details section we have already created. I am going to remove that and in this place we are going to put that content. So now we have this content in between this td. If I want I can put the tabs and put it. Now what I do, if I say file save, go to browser and refresh, you can see the details added automatically. Let me increase the width of this td little bit more. I go to default.html page, I add the maybe 250 looks better, file, save, go to browser and refresh. Okay, that looks good. Now what I want actually is um, I want to align it properly, this box. So how do I align? Let's see. First thing, I put this content in a paragraph, opening paragraph and a closing paragraph file, save, go to browser and refresh. Okay. Next thing, I am going to put this content aligned to top. So what I do, I go to the TR, here we have the TD and this TD, I am going to say V align, V A L I G N align to top. We know that V align stands for vertical align, whatever the content we have in this TD is going to be aligned top. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that I have aligned it top. If I want, I can put it down also. I think it is better to put it down. Maybe let's see bottom. We give here instead of top, I give bottom. Then I say file, save, go to browser and refresh that looks good I think so then here I need some breaks so what I do I go here I add a break tag br file save go to browser and refresh we have a break again I need a break somewhere over here so I add one more break after this house number I add break then after Hyderabad I am going to add one break after the mobile number, I am going to add one more break. Then I say file, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that it looks something like this. But I want to align the text to the right. I don't want it to be on the left align in the TD. So what I do, I go to this and I add ALIGN align RIGHT right. File, save, go to browser and refresh can see that text is aligned to the right. I want to add some space in between the content. So I add some breaks, more breaks. So let me add one more break here. BR tag 
here also I am going to add a BR tag copy paste copy paste then paste file save go to browser and refresh I think it looks good at least uh, we can be able to see the content properly good let's proceed further next thing is I am going to increase the height or uh, the size of these two fonts to more so what I do my profile I go to my profile text here I add the font tag font font size s i z e font size I am going to set to maybe 5 looks good let's see then I say here closing font 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 file save go to browser refresh now my profile looks better now I want to highlight Manjunath Chidre so I am going to make it bolder so I go to this paragraph and before M I am going to add the B tag before the break tag I am going to close the B tag file save go to browser and refresh that looks good then what I want, I want to increase the height of this uh, thickness or I can say size of this home page text also to 5 or maybe 4. Let's see, I go down, here we have a home page text, I'm going to add the font tag to it, F-O-N-T font and I say size equal to, I say 4, let's see how it looks. Then I say here closing font tag, file, save go to browser and refresh I think that's okay that looks good next I am going to add some navigation here because we need the navigation bar we need to add some content to it to add navigation I have already some content copied these are the details I'm going to have I'm also going to put here contact me link will be there I'm going to copy this from here and paste it in the navigation section I go to navigation here I'm going to remove it hit enter put some tabs then I'm going to paste the content over here so now we are going to have here home qualification different links we are going to create file save go to browser and refresh it looks something like this but I want to add links to them also you can see I need some breaks so what I do means I'm going to add break over here br forward slash I'm going to copy this br tag and paste it down paste it here paste here paste here paste here paste here paste 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 I think that's enough file save go to browser and refresh you can see we have links properly now I am going to add the anchor tags so that they can become hyperlinks to add the anchor tag uh, I'm going to write just before this H I'm going to add the anchor tag href hyperlink reference not yet decided so I put hash for a slash uh, greater than sign then just before the break I am going to close the anchor tag for a slash a now similarly I'm going to copy this copy and paste for all paste 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 then I'm going to copy this closing anchor tag and paste just before all the break tags here paste 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 and paste file save go to browser and refresh you can see that now we have hyperlinks for all of them if we want we can add some more breaks in between to get more distance between the hyperlinks or we can leave it as it is it is better let me add some breaks no problem it won't harm if I add more breaks copy paste 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 file save go to browser and refresh that looks nice now we have the navigation and content home page footer you can see now this page looks better something like this right 
we got the layout also we got hyperlinks also so hope you guys have understood how you can create the navigation section increase the font size and create the layout for this tutorial this much is enough friends in the next tutorial we add some color and all make it much more better so for this tutorial this much is enough guys for more benefits please subscribe like comment and share see you in the next tutorial keep learning keep coding keep sharing